Hello everyone, today we're going to be unfortunately talking about some frustrating news surrounding the Arizona Coyotes. Now before we start, please make sure to join the Hockey Brigade by subscribing if you are new. Now let's get to it. So, a report came out today basically saying that the Arizona Coyotes might have to share a stadium with the Arizona State Sun Devils hockey team. Not only that, but it seems that it could be a three to four year plan to stay in that stadium for the franchise as they're hoping for a brand new stadium to be built in Tempe, Arizona. I gotta be honest, this is so embarrassing for a number of reasons. The first is that the Sun Devils own the stadium, at least from what I've heard, meaning the Coyotes would have to be tenants to a college. And second is that the stadium only holds 5,000 fans. Yikes, throw that on to the embarrassment to the league, and it makes me feel frustrated because this is where the team is at currently. I am just so frustrated that this franchise is where they're at, and their fans in the league deserve better than this. They really do. It is. I feel so bad for their fans. Apparently, however, the league has no problem with it. As NHL Deputy Commissioner Bill Daly said, quote, It depends on the totality of circumstances, but I wouldn't rule it out, end quote. They might be okay with this. I'm shocked by it, but they might actually be fun. On top of that, it appears that the Yotes wouldn't be allowed to use the ASU's training facilities due to NCAA rules, meaning the team would need to temporarily build facilities for themselves that could cost up to reported 15 to $20 million for a potential three-year solution. I guess the only bright side here is that there might be some show of commitment from the club to stay in Arizona, as they said, quote, as we have said many times, we are completely committed to building our future in Arizona. As part of that process, we are excited to be exploring some great temporary arena options here before we move into a new permanent home in the Valley." End quote. I don't even know what to make out of that because they say that this is a great temporary option. It only holds 5,000 people. You'd have to be renting it out and who knows, maybe you'll make Arizona State mad while you're at it because you can't pay your bills. We'll have to see. And their current venue in Glendale is kicking them out this summer because they weren't paying bills. The, the city didn't feel like they were making money. And this could be a solution for the time being, but it just seems ridiculous. And it also seems ridiculous that Commissioner Gary Bettman doesn't want to even be vocal about this. We know that he doesn't want to relocate the Desert Dogs. Can't say if fault them because obviously the fans I wouldn't want to have to make them upset but he's been very vocal about keeping them in the southwest the recent news certainly doesn't help his position as fans from around the league have called for the embattled team to relocate as they've had a very hard time finding their footing in the desert not going to say it is the fans fault by any means because it is definitely not the case there's been so many factors about why this team has struggled to find a footing out in Arizona but it just feels like for the fan base, they never get a chance to just sit back, breathe, and enjoy their hockey team in the off chance that the team's actually good, which I think is a big reason why they haven't been able to find a footing because they haven't been a very successful team in their 25-plus years in Arizona. We'll have to see how it goes. Obviously, we have a lot of things to worry about, wonder about, and see what's going to be happening here. And I don't know. I, I'm not very sure where this is going to lead. I think that it's still up in the air on where the Coyotes could or could not end up. Although I'm really hopeful they can stay in the Copper State. Again, who knows? Maybe they'll go to Houston. I, we'll have to see. But yeah, do you want the Oats to stay in Arizona or relocate? Let me know down in the comments down below. Be sure to make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And then subscribe if you are new and want to see more hockey content. Anyway, everybody stay safe. Have a great night. You go love hockey, all right? Goodbye, Brigadiers and Brigadettes. This is your captain signing off. Have a great night.